abdominal pain is one of a group of conditions known as the abdominal pain-related functional gastrointestinal disorders, which is quite a mouthful. However, um, it's important because these uh, few conditions do share quite a few uh, similar features. Other ones in this group that you may have heard of are irritable bowel syndrome and functional dyspepsia. And of course, functional abdominal pain is the one that you are um, hearing about uh, as you have possibly been diagnosed with this. Functional abdominal pain differs from the other two because patients get tummy pains at or below the belly button. Also, the pain of functional abdominal pain is not associated with changes in your poops, either the frequency or the appearance of them. The pain is also not improved after having a bowel movement. Keep these differences in mind for later as the treatment options for each condition do differ a bit. However, in all of these conditions, the, ch the child or adolescent has tummy pain at least once a week. It is a prominent feature. It is also um, cr chronic, which means it occurs on a daily basis for more than two months, or it repeats itself um, in an unpredictable fashion for at least two months.